Hello everyone, welcome back. In the previous series of IIB lecture, IBM integration bus, I have taught everything and the few of the topic I left, I will also cover that. That is the REST API things and the, some exception handling things. I have left that, I will cover that. This series, that series was totally on the uh, Hindi language and uh, I have covered everything thoroughly. thoroughly. And the platform, the tool that I have worked on it is the IIB version 10. This series, uh, after the lots of people asked me, I have I am going to start in the English for the is that is the IBM is App Connect Enterprises, and uh, this whole series will be in the English itself. If you, uh, I am going to show you some comments. You can see from the uh, various various users uh, they are requesting for the english video and i'm i cannot show you all the comments but i am going to see show you some comments and mail here hi are you providing any training in the ibms he is expecting some training so that's reason i am starting a training from from the ibms hi brother could you please make some topic in english so that's reason uh, he is a uh, he is not he does not know Hindi. that's reason i am going to make a video of this series in english hello your explanation in the video is excellent are there any offline coaching center available for the ibm app connect and app connect enterprises again for those they are looking for the offline coachings and that's all thing they can get the video in this series in the ibm app connect enterprises in detail so they don't need to worry about that make video about the error handling how how will you how will we write the code for that again error handling thing all thing we are i'm going to cover so don't need to worry about that again from the one of the user at the english please that's again because he does not know hindi that's again he's expecting hindi again could you please provide the english subtitle again they are expecting some uh, video on the english subtitle even i am not uh, teaching in english that's again i uh, thought to make a video on in English in continuation of please upload a video through the handle failure through the log node try catch node and the use framework and flow order node again these all thing the error handling thing that is the try catch node and the failure node I am going to cover everything in detail so you don't need to worry about that so let's start the IBM is let me give a brief of the what is the difference between the IIB and what is the difference between the S. Till the version 10, that is the version 8, 9, 10, these all things are called as a IIB, that is the I, IBM integration bus. After the version 10, that is the version 11, and the version 12, that is the called as a S, that is the apt connect enterprises. So, what is the difference between the both IIB and the IBM S? That's question. Uh, many things, many times the people, uh, it should come into your mind to what is the difference between the IIB and what is the difference between the S. And this is the popular question of the also interview. In the interview, it, it is always asked what is the difference between both. The, till the IIB, uh, uh, lots of future uh, that in the S has been uh, that present in IIB, lots of the node in the IIB was present and uh, that was uh, in removed in the that is removed in the S. The few of the node is introduced in turn uh, S and the few of the node has been removed from the S that was present in the IIB. Apart from them, for, apart from that, S is compatible for the cloud things because you know our uh, world is going toward the cloud everything now industry is switching toward the cloud because uh, in the if you are not going through the cloud then the we need to get dependency on the data center and it should be our data center but if you move to to the other clouds then uh, we don't need to uh, remain uh, dependent on the data center we can use the google cloud or the either microsoft azure cloud or either aws cloud that's reason ibm has introduced upgraded this application so that they can make a compatible with the cloud also now 
what we are going to cover in this lecture series in this lecture series i just uh, retain the tool that i am going to cover it that is the first i am going to cover the ibm s version 12 toolkit that is we are going to learn the version 12 okay after that i have a, a lecture series for the mq explorer if you don't uh, have learned it you can just search I be uh, MQ series. There is a, a playlist. You can go and learn the MQ thing. But again, in this lecture series, we can going to use the MQ Explorer for the uh, uh, browsing of the message and seeing the message. The IS version 12 toolkit is going to use for the development purpose. MQ Explorer I am going to use for the uh, message browsing and the see the message coming to the queue or not for the messaging purpose again rfh util this is a tool i am going to use for the read write browse move the message postman and the soap ui these all these two are the both the uh, web service testing tool postman is used for the rest web service and the soap ui is used for, uh, is used for the so best web service and these two web uh, tool are we are going to use for the testing the web service oracle sql developer you can use any any oracle uh, sql developer the, i am going to use the oracle sql developer or the post grade uh, S sql uh, developer because uh, you can use any database it does not matter what database but because we are going to use the database to connect the iiv application with the database so that we can do the insert application uh, and delete and whatever the data person can be we can perform with the iiv uh, that is the ace toolkit okay after that is console we are going to configure it in s console we can write any command to see whether the broker is running or not apart from that mqs i said db parameters to set the configuration details these all things we are going to use using the s console okay so this is all we are going to cover in the s series in s series we are going to cover everything in english and after the lots of people comment i am going to start it so hope you are going to enjoy this series and again if you have any question doubt you can comment me you can send me a mail already my mail is in the description thank you thank you all